As the holiday season is upon us, shopping malls become hectic as people rush to buy their presents. But some families cannot get to the stores to buy presents because they are caring for a sick or injured child in the hospital. Eyewitness News reporter Ravithi Janaswamy explains how Geisinger Janet Weiss Children's Hospital found a way to give them some holiday help. Stuffed animals, books, and board games, oh my. But this isn't your average toy shop. In fact, this isn't even a real toy shop. It's the lobby of Geisinger Janet Weiss Children's Hospital. Volunteers and hospital staff put together this makeshift toy shop for the families of pediatric patients at the hospital. But when you're in the hospital and you have no time to do anything but take care of your child in the hospital, Christmas just kind of goes out of your mind a little bit. But you still have children who expect Christmas. Certified Child Life Specialist Nancy Ramhap says the free toys were donated by corporations, brownie troops, volunteers and more. Families were asked whether they were shopping for a boy or girl and what age range their child was. Then a volunteer walked them through the different sections of toys, helping them find the perfect presents. This holiday tradition has been going on for 20 years. Ramhap says she sees all sorts of emotions on people's faces when they see the amount of toys they can choose from. Sometimes it's tears, sometimes it's absolute joy, sometimes it's complete relief. The families will stop us and tell us their story and say, gosh, we didn't even know how we were going to make Christmas happen this year. I was crying, to be honest, when I walked in there because it's very humbling that, I'm sorry, it's very humbling that people do this. Um, being a sick kid is never good. Being a sick kid at Christmas is... I'm sorry. It's tough. It's tough. There's so many people here ready to help give back through Geisinger, and it's amazing. In Danville, Ravthi Janaswamy, Eyewitness News. Organizers say last year they served 350 children through the holiday toy shop.